deal still needs approval from Virginia's General Assembly and the Alexandria City Council. But if that happens, construction will start in 2025. The teams will move in 2028. News Force Joseph Olmo has been covering this story all week. And this morning, he took the pulse of these two competing communities. Well, Joseph, a lot of people have a lot to say about all of this. OK, so what are people saying? I'll let them speak for themselves, Millette, <laughs> because everybody has an opinion. You know, everybody in the DMV has heard about this, even if you aren't a sports fan and even if you've never been to Capital One Arena. So today we wanted to continue that conversation. After all, as much as this is for the team, it's also about the people, the fans who come to see these teams play. We posted up at two metro stops today. Gallery Place, the current stop that serves the home of these two teams, and Potomac Yard, which could soon be the next metro stop to serve a major venue. We asked one simple question. Yay or nay for Capitals and Wizards going over to Virginia, sir? That'll be a yay for me. They need to get out of here. They're not, they not doing nothing here in the city, no way. It's hard. It's a controversial answer. I'm, I'm completely split. Stay here, we are nay. Nay to the move to Virginia. Same. <laughs> Ooh, no, no. Nay. Are you a yay or a nay for the Caps and Wizards moving over to Virginia? Nay. I don't have an opinion just quite yet. A nay. Yay. My partner thinks not. I think it's great. So we have a divided household here. Ooh, we do, yeah. She's concerned about traffic, maybe crime, parking. The nation's capital. And it needs to have a sports team right here. DC team should stay in DC. Because I'm worried about my rent, but I think it'll be really fun. You're not worried about over congestion or anything like that? Uh, a little bit, but that's kind of showbiz. We're close to the city. It happens. Too much traffic. They belong here. Why? So the name is DC, Washington Capitals, Washington Wizards. Baltimore Ravens, they're in Baltimore. Exactly. There you go. Yeah, yay or nay? Nay. nay. How come? Ain't nobody going to, I don't want to go to Virginia. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> that, that sentiment, right? I don't want to go all the way to Virginia. That's a big one. That's been a big one. A lot of people say, listen, that traffic across the bridge is already unbearable. Well, remember, Potomac Yard, where this new arena is supposedly going uh, to be, is already served by a metro station. It opened up earlier this year. But as of right now, there's no definitive plan, Millette, to address the traffic dilemma going into and out of northern Virginia. Millette, back to you. We'll continue to hear the yays and the nays as we continue to talk about this. Because sure. we still don't have this thing etched in stone just yet. The ink isn't dry. We need to vote. It is not. And what a surprise that everybody in the DMV is just divided about this. Everybody has their own opinion. All right. We'll keep talking about it. Thank you so much, Joseph Omo. We'll continue working for you with what all of this means to our region, taxpayers and fans of both teams as the plan works its way through Virginia's General Assembly. Stay with us on air in the NBC Washington app and on NBCWashington.com.